But what prompted this actually today was I got that delivered today. Now, what is it? That is an Indigo, Indigo top shelf camera bag, which was a Kickstarter bag. So they raised a million quid through Kickstarter and I, I sponsored, I paid my money back in March. It was supposed to, I was supposed to received it in July, um, but it's only just come obviously due to the pandemic, etc. And I was really looking forward to this. You can just hold it in front of you and just swap your cameras over and your lenses. What? <laughs> I know what it reminds me of when you were trying it on earlier. It's like an ice cream seller at the theatre. Oh yes, <laughs> ice cream, sir. There we go. Have an ice cream. It does. Little That's girl. Yeah, yeah, it is. it is. It is. So it anyway. came today and yeah. Controversial, I'm gonna stick it on eBay. <gasps> well, the idea is you wear it like a, a sling bag. There's loads of YouTube videos on there which um, were put out at the time they were got their Kickstarter campaign going. So it was before, it was people that, you know, hadn't really got production units using them. They were just advertising the um, Kickstarter campaign. And you can wear it as a sling, whiz it around in 1.1 seconds or something they say, open this up. So then you can either swap cameras or swap lenses on a body without yeah. having to take the bag off you without having to put it down, mm. which is fine. As you say, you end up looking a bit like an ice cream salesman in a bit. It's like it's time. So. But you know, which, and you know, I'm fine with that. The mm. idea is great. I just could not get the cameras I wanted in there. No. What I wanted in there to say was 7200 on the body and another body with a lens on it. So I was just quickly swapping from one camera to another. Mm and it just doesn't fit, it's just not deep enough. I can see the so, idea of it. You don't want to put, cause sometimes I don't want to put my bag on the ground, it's dirty and you know, yeah. and you have to bend down and like that. This is kind of like a quick release. You turn it around, it opens up like a yeah. tray. You, yeah, yeah, yeah. And you act like, it's almost like a little table. That's to why it's called the top shelf, I guess. Right, but, okay. um, so the theory is good. Uh, and you can put a laptop in the back of it and all that sort of stuff. But if I can't get the gear in that I wanted, then the rest of it is irrelevant. Really. Yeah, that's true. So, yeah. and this is a little bit fiddly that, but yeah, you know, I'm not sure of that so, mechanism to be fair. It's a so bit... I think it's one of those things that's a great idea in theory, but I'm not convinced. Okay. And I bought this, I paid for this back in March. Mm. If I was doing it now, if, I, if it came up now, I wouldn't do yeah. it because since then we bought, we both bought one of these, yeah, yeah. uh, etc., okay. which are great. So, and 50 quid. I okay. mean, this is $250 now to go and buy one. Um, so it's an expensive bag. Mm. I mean, those low pro 450 AWs that we've got are about 150 and they are yeah, brilliant. Yeah. They're brilliant. Those are so, um, okay. So it's not for you. I, not for I me. can't see, I don't, I don't can't use it for wedding or anything I'll like sell that. It it's, too, <laughs> it's too impractical, like using it like a tray. I'll, I'd rather just have a bag at my feet. Just... 195 quid oh, to you, Russell. Wow, thanks. Sold yeah. to the man on the left. I mean, it's a well made bag, we've got it nothing is, against yeah. the actual. But again, the actual hole that it goes in is quite narrow because it's all curved in. Mm. And it's very shallow once you actual put your stuff in because it's well padded. Yeah. But, and I just, I'm yeah. just not in love with it. So. Okay, right. So that's. Not getting the top. Controversial, I'm sure, because I'm, I yeah. bet there'll be loads of YouTube videos so coming out. that's not going on the top shelf of our opinion. No, it's, it's not going to get our approved no. stuff.